da 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 Hello friends, and welcome to another demo day with me, Janky Shenanigans. I am very excited to be presenting this game for you guys today. This game is my ace in the hole demo. <laughs> I, because I've already played it, I love it, it is wonderful, it is the game that I was saving for rainy nights in case I, I absolutely need a demo. And since I'm recording this one, and I recorded last week's, tonight, on the same night, um, and I couldn't find any other demos on Steam I really want to play, I decided to, to pull this one out. So this is a game from Kickstarter by Onegro Studios, I think I pronounced that right, called Moira. And it is wonderful. It is, it is inspired by Game Boy, and it is a spellcasting RPG game. It has an overworld, which you will see, and it's all very, very old school Game Boy, and I just love it so. I love it so. And let me, oh, I gotta show you this. This is awesome. So you can go in here. What color would you like? There are many. There's my first adventure. Uh, Geographic Dude. This is fun. If you get into the later ones, they're like, obviously, throwbacks to other things, like, um, Bottom of the Well, Land of Mustaches, or Little Bounty Hunter, or Barrels and Tongs. Oh my gosh, it's just delightful. Um, I am, of course, going to go with Nostalgia Gray for the time being, because Nostalgia I'll probably come back and change that more later. Um, but yes, this game is so much fun. I saw uh, Jesse Cox play it, and I played it myself, and it is just, mm, it's a blast. And it's actually, they, they met their Kickstarter goals, they even met their stretch goals. It's greenlit on Steam. You can actually pre-order it right now, if you like what you see, which I hope you do, because it's awesome. But enough, enough of my blabbling. <laughs> Let's, let's get going. Just, I get to make all sorts of goofy voices for this one, so I also like that. The Kingdom of Animals. I think. <laughs> is well known for its great wizards and many magic schools that exist since time immemorial. <laughs> Zeppelini. At Nemos' greatest wizard is also a teacher at Oreno's Mage School. Zeppelini has gone missing and no one knows his whereabouts. Oh my gosh, it's moving so fast. To make things worse, there have been reports of strange happenings all around the world. And monsters have been lurking about. Oh no. And roaming free across the countryside. Rubik, a young magic student in Zeppelini's grows tired of waiting for news of his master. With the wand that Zeppelini gave him in hand, Ze Zeppelini, Zeppelli, he goes on an adventure to find his teacher. But will he survive? Yeah. Oh, we'll teach him more than he can imagine. What? I think I missed a line in there. Sorry. Rubik, are you up yet? You are late to school, young man. Oh no. Let me get dressed, Mom. Probably. Mom? Yeah, it is. It is, Mom. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Look at these mad hops. I love this. Mad hops. Alright. Let's get rolling. Have you seen the time? You should be at school already. Hurry to class, young man. And don't forget your wand, as you always do. I have it. 
I have it right here. It's... Yeah, there we go. It's magic, Mom. Magic. Get off my back. Hurry to class, young man. You know what? You know what? Just because you told me to? I'm not gonna. Hello, sir. Wubuk, your teacher is looking for you. Go to school at once. Alright. But first, I want to go this way. Oh, but I can't. Oh, uh, well. Let's see who else is out. Hello! The Betty and I used to meet at this very cliff every now and then to talk. Oh, <laughs> meet at this cliff every now and then to talk. That makes more sense. Now it's just me rolling sketches. But they're beautiful sketches, aren't they? Actually, I can't tell. I know a way to tell, though. Uh, 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 uh. All this junk. We'll figure one out later. In the meantime, let's switch over to my first adventure. Ooh! So many greens. Hello, sir. Nico Skipping Clash, that smarty pants. Always researching stuff no one's ever heard of. Indeed he is, sir. Indeed he is. Aw, what are you two kids to? See that boy over there? He doesn't have a clue I really want him to notice me. He only talks about plastic models. Aww. Hey, kid. Notice her. See that girl over there? I think I really, really like her. Aww. Oh, she's looking this way. Let's pretend we're talking about plastic models. Quick. Aww. <laughs> you crazy star cut cross lovers. I can't wait to get home and play some magic games. Magic the Gathering. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what magic games they play here. Hi, Rubik. I was looking for you. Your friend Nico is missing, and I need you to find him. You have the power to mimic other people's and enemies' abilities. I need you to use this power. Press X to use your wand to mimic my magic. Alright. Beam. Oh! Look at that! Look at that beam! What? Well done! Now you have my favorite magic beam! Now pay attention! You can release the power you're using pressing C. Ah, I see. I see! <laughs> and you can use beam again by pre selecting it at the menu, pressing. Or using A and S. Rubik, use your power to find Nico and bring him back. Talk to the town guards, they'll help you. Alright, let's find our pal Nico. Oh, yeah, so what, what he was discussing. Ah, yes, there are my powers. And there's other powers I can get. In the group water. Grimoire? Spellbook? I don't know. Uh, Bestiary? Never gotten there yet. Quest log. I must use my powers to obtain the teacher's ability. And now I must find Nico. Inventory? Nothing. Oh, but let's change up the color again, shall we? Let's do... Rival's Den. See how that one looks. Whoa! Lots of purple. Alright. Presto said you would come and use Z to release your power and, press, and X to make, mimic me, Rubric. And please be careful, Nico was last seen going east towards the castle. Alright. Ah. So I can go back to mimic. 
And now I got a sword. What? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh, but it gets better. Ready? Watch this. There it is. Alright, watch this. Ready? Sword. And theme. Magic sword. Theme. And sword. Beamerang. Oh, but I'm totally using this. I love this. Ready for this? Magic sword. Magic sword. Whoops. Sword. Beamerang. Magic sword. Whoa! And toss swords. Overworld. And the bridge is out. Sad man. That's okay. We can head toward the castle. The castle of confusion. Try to find our buddy Mika. I can figure out how to actually go there. There we go. Alright, here we go. Oh no, I'm not dealing with that guy. We are magic sword. Boom! Enemy identified. We'll we'll check that out in a minute. Yeah. Let's just blow out some candles. Come at me. Come at me. Try to come at me. Weird little Koopas. You would rip off from another game franchise. Oh crap. Uh. No, I want the magic sword. I just need to remember how to jump. Hit him! Yeah! I got this. I got this. Checkpoint. Love it. down first. Let's see what's up down here. Oh, a spike pit. That's what's, that's what's up down here. Well, let's jump across it. Because we can. And... I'm not sure this one. Oh! Yeah, I remember this. Oh, no. Crap. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. There's a checkpoint. There's a checkpoint. It's what checkpoints are for. Okay, yeah. Now I remember what's down here. It's a heart potion. It's like another heart. And I need all the hearts I can get. <laughs> As seen when I jumped into this spike pit. I was gonna say spike of pits or something, I don't know. Out the candles. No, can't do a thing. Run! Alright. Try to hit me while I'm standing up on the block. You can't aim that high. Ah, uh, but you can there. It's cool. It's cool. Ah, crap. That's fine. I got you. I got your number. I got your number, Jack. Go. Okay, so potions refill your energy. Yes. And then hearts are obviously out. The magic sword unfortunately uses like a hell of a ton of energy. There we go. Can get high enough. Can get high enough to hit him. Where are we going? That mysterious fellow. What a weird picture to have. There have been pictures on the walls, haven't there? I <laughs> like just now that I want to get in. It's locked. Alright, fine. We'll go around that. See what there is to see. See? Sunsets. 
sunsets are nice pictures to have. Or creepy people. Don't, don't do creepy people. Oh, look. I can fall down through platforms. No! Oh. And magic. I got the word magic. Oh crap, I landed right on him. Yes! <laughs> okay, so what is this enemy identified thing? Because I haven't been at all. The Dark Knight, the Short Knight, the Evil Mage, and the Evil Eye. They're all super aggressive, because of course they are. Let's change up the colors again. Warby Land 99. Yeah. Nice, let's do that. Hey! What up, dude? Thanks for a lot, Rubik. I owe you one. I thought I would be back here forever. I don't know what I'm doing. I came here to look. What am I even doing? I, I meant to do like super nasally, but I don't think it's coming across that way at all. Me? I came here to look for a clue in these books about where the Great Zeppelini might be. Okay. But then the armies came to life and I ended up locked in here. But hey, I found an old book written by the Great Zeppelini himself. It's about spell combination and ancient. Pfft. I'm so ahead of you already. In ancient times, there were mages who combined spells to create new ones. And take a look at this symbol behind us. It has a symbol of a sword etched on it. Maybe you can open this door with your power, Rubik. What if you combine your powers? Try accessing the menu and combining your powers, the sword and beam powers, and that'll win it. Psh! I'm already ahead of you. You don't even know, kid. Boom. Open that door. This oh, yeah. Alright, wait, hold on. What'd you say? Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, and please tell my parents and everyone else that I'm safe. Alright. You just, are you just gonna chill here? Alright, I'm just gonna let chill there. As I go through the magic door to who knows where. I know where, but you don't know where. To a strange factory place. Oh, this is one of my favorite things. Ready for this? You ready for this? Oh, I didn't activate it. I turned into a cute little mouth. Aww. It's adorable. It's adorable. Let's use the beamerang for a while, because that one's fun. Yeah, that's right. 
right. I I should have jumped. <laughs> That evil eye. That's right. Ah, crap. Oh, good. It's a shortfall. It's fine. From here, you can't tell, so it looks like I might just be jumping off into a bottomless pit, but I wasn't, so that's good. Good! What? What on earth was that there? Robotron, which is neutral, and found at the castle. But that's a lie, because we're in the abandoned factory. Uh, well. Let's go up here, probably. This is something, right? Well, there's an evil eye up here. Oh, got it. Cool! Oh, look, my magic has increased. Oh, and then I can just jump back out there, so I don't, I don't have to turn back into a mouse. I could turn back into a mouse. I have to. Oh, I could turn back into a mouse to get in there. Or I could just fall down whatever pit's coming up. Evil eye, evil eye. Nailed it. Ah, crap. Oh, look. I didn't even do it on purpose. I just fell down because oh, I'm awful. It's fine. Hey, I want to mimic you, Mouse. Yay. Mouse mimic. Now I'm a cute little mouse. Look at my cute little cat. I'm gonna be honest, I'm still not entirely sure what, what, uh, oh crap, I gotta do something else now. Hey! Yeah, all I was gonna say was, I'm still not quite sure how best to do this whenever I'm filming at the same time. Because on one hand, I kind of feel the need to keep talking the entire time. On the other, I feel like I don't have to be talking every single second. Oh wait, there's something good down there. Look at this. Hello, little mouse. Hello. I make the mouse. Close. Yeah, sometimes I feel like I should be talking all the time, or at least like commentating on the game, and then other times I'm like, maybe it would be better to just... Oh, snap. Okay. Oh, dear. Halls of Death. We have entered them, apparently. Who left these spiked instruments running? That's a bad decision on someone's part. <laughs> Yay. Ah, 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 jump up. Well, that was nothing. I got hit by the spike thing. I broke the spike thing, but I also got hit by the spike thing, so I don't think that did anything helpful. Hey, 
Yay, checkpoint. Yay. Do, do, do. Ooh, battle. Hey, before we start battling, before we do battle, let's change the skin and everything again. I like changing how things look. It suddenly occurs to me that I could have gone the other way and it would have been much faster. But um, the land of the mustaches. Yeah, let's do that. Nope, nope, don't mimic. Do something helpful. Like Beamerang. Okay. Ah, uh, this way. Ah, okay. Oh, weird. No, no, no. These boomerangs are doing damage. <laughs> I don't know how much damage these things do, but I hope it's a lot. Ah, 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 ah. Run this way. And. Ah, crap. Well, now I'm screwed. About to pull the chain. Ah, crap. Yeah, he is. Alright. Patterns. Oh no. I stepped right into that. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, please let me beat him. be so close. Oh, dang it. And there's no way to hop around him. Dang it. Look at him. He is so close to broke. Please do just break. Yes! Yes! Come on, this time. I think my camera's fallen a little, but that's okay. That just highlights the intensity of what was going on there. And I get a new power! Yay! The T-Bomb. T-Bomb. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go ahead and combine some powers. Okay. I'm not quite sure... Where that cut out on me. I know it cut out somewhere. I was in the heat of the battle, so I wasn't paying attention. But the important thing is that I defeated the boss, and I got awesome new swag power. So, uh, oh, did that, did that, oh, that doesn't do anything. Okay. Well, let's mix the bomb with the sword then, and get a dagger, because that makes sense. And another sword. Let's check out what they're about. The E-Sword! I don't know what that does. And the E-Dagger. Well, I guess we'll just have to test them out on some enemies. E-Sword. <laughs> Alright, let's see what this is about. The E-Sword. E-sword! Oh, that's fun. <laughs> Come at me. I'll blow you up with every swing. I have to, because I'm only down to one heart. So I need to be extra cautious. Ah! Ah, crap. What is that thing? Some awful kamikaze bomb. 
Bombino. It says that it's neutral, but that seems unlikely. That's fine. I'll just switch to the dagger. The e dagger. And jump. And jump. And I can't jump. But I can do this. And hop on the up. Yeah! I already know what's up. Did you forget how to combine powers? To reach higher places, try combining T-Bomb and Sword in the menu. Nope, I already know what's up. And jump. And jump. Ah, crap. And jump. And jump. And jump. And jump. And jump. Ah, crap. Right into the spikes. But it's fine. Just avoid it. I think it's the best solution right now. Ah, crap. No, no, no. I'm not doing what I want you to do. This I'm particularly proud of, um, only because whenever I was watching Jesse do his playthrough of this game, he totally missed this area. So I was super proud that I was able to find it and get the extra heart. I was just like, ah, but you didn't check up there, and then I looked up there and I found stuff, and I'm like, yeah, see? All about looking in the hidden places. Crap. How did you get here? The bridge is broken. What? A magic door to the abandoned factory? And then you cleared the road? Wait till I tell the others. No one will believe me. Well, maybe we should keep it between ourselves. So just get stitches. Um, anyway. Yeah, there's a lot of interesting people. Hello. Floating is just... Floating is just one of the many techniques you can learn here and new. But I gotta warn you, the training is really intense. Yeah, that's a good voice for that character, right? Oh, look at you, dude! Mommy made this totally awesome star hat for me! I'm just afraid I'll attract lightning bolts during thunderstorms! Aw, but you look adorable in it, so that's the important thing. 
Hello. How's it going, Thrasher? Everybody here calls me Beauty, but in fact, I'm just a regular girl using a lot of love potion. Alright, stay away from you at parties. Is this the door I need to go into? No. Okay. There is a lot happening here. It's true. I'm just trying to shorten things up by <laughs> by finding where I need to go. Are you going there? Okay, this. I think that's where I need to be. Hey, look! Hey, Rubik! It's so good to see you! Have you come to see me? Oh, I know you wouldn't resist coming to see my training camp. Have you talked to my mom? How's she doing? And Nico? What? Locked in the castle? OMG! Oh, here it's also been crazy since Mr. Zappelli's disappeared. The teacher have been pushing us to train harder and harder. Hello. So you were Rubik Zappelli's apprentice? How did I know that? Oh, I know lots of things. Boy, lots of things. Well, well, magic and to welcome to new magic camp. You look, uh, you come looking for clues about your master's whereabouts, huh? Yes, I know that too. Unfortunately, one of the few things I do not know is where he is. How could he leave us at a time like this? That old fart. <laughs> Preposterous. Maybe it's a good thing you've come. Listen to me, boy. I sense an evil presence growing stronger and stronger, and it's close. I can feel it. I need you to go to the deep woods and find out what or who is there. You know Ashley, right? Ashley, go with him. Please be careful. Remember, this is no training. There's something evil there. I feel it. Intense. I'm glad you're here, Rubik. Your Baba has really been on edge these days. She's asking me to come with her today. Maybe she sensed she were coming here too? She is very wise and also very powerful. She must really trust you since she has forbidden anyone to go into the woods. Well, no you standing around. Let's head to the woods. Yes, indeed. But first... Let's put on our little bounty hunter. Oh my gosh, that is... No. Let's actually not do that. Let's... Let's just go back to Nostalgia Grave. That was a good color. Nostalgia gray. And off we go. Into the woods we go again. We have to every now and then. Hello. Your Baba said you may pass. Keep going forward. And you'll, you're, you're going to reach the deep woods. It's a very dangerous place, so be careful, okay? Alright. I will try to not to. I will try not to. See what I did there? Hey look, it's my friend Ashley. Here we are, new deep woods. This is where Yababa is sensing an evil presence. Let's race the other side of the woods. Try to keep up. Alright. Ah! That's right, there are frogs here. Attack frogs. Nasty, nasty things. Boom. Alright, let's go through here. There's something. Alright. And up we go. That was a mistake. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Ugh. I think I'm just really tired. It's it's been a day. And yeah. It's been a day and I'm just tired and I still have Witcher stuff to record tonight. And Trying to find the energy. Trying to find the energy. Plus, for demo days, I'm actually here on camera with you guys. So, 
um, I feel like I have to present an interesting face. If that sentence made any sense, which I don't know that it did. But, whatever. You probably know what I mean, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Let's go out. Let's find out what's up here. Oh, crap. That's a bee. What is that? There's actually all sorts of, if I remember correctly, there's actually all sorts of stuff to explore around here. I just don't remember what, where most of it is. Oh, but there's a checkpoint, so that's good. I think there's all sorts of hidden stuff through here, but to be honest, it's pretty running kind of long. And I feel like maybe I should try to wrap things up. So I'm just gonna keep pushing forward. You'll just have to find out for yourself what else is hidden in the woods. There we go. I guess you'll just have to find out for yourselves what secrets the woods hold. Oh no, it's a cute little mouse again. Hello, mouse. Where does this lead? Somewhere cool, I bet. I think I missed a few things along the way there, but... There you are! I was starting to worry! Looks like you could use some new training! <laughs> oh, Ashley! Stop! Really, seriously. Awful part. Why don't you spend a few days with us? I bet you could learn a thing or two that would help in your... Earthquake! What's going on? What was that? I feel... Rubik, hurry! There's something wrong here! Oh, no, don't run off without me. That's... Oh, that's the way you get hit. With something... Oh, no! Screams! <gasps> A colorful person. Rubik, help me. We must warn the others. Why are you in color? Warn the others? Foolish child. It is futile toward anyone. <laughs> what is this? Are you angry that I hurt your friend? This is priceless. This is way out of your league, child. You can't do anything to stop me. No one in this world can stop me. Now go to sleep, little one. 
Oh, snap. I really hope you wake up in color. That would be awesome. But dang. What a story that sets up, right? Right? Oh. To be continued. So that's Moira. And isn't it delightful? If you want to see a better playthrough of it, look at Jesse Cox's playthrough, which is delightful. It's one of his Fan Friday series. Yeah. It, but it's great. But I love this game. It looks really fun. I'm excited to play more of it uh, whenever they release the full version. And see exactly where all the story goes. But for now, that's all I have to say. So, action adventure spellcasting RPG based on Game Boy, and it's just story filled and, and intriguing to every degree. So, that's all I have for demo day today. It's true. But if you like what you saw, you should definitely like the video. And you should also comment because I love reading comments and share because sharing is, is wonderful thing to do. But more than anything, you should subscribe, because whenever you subscribe, that tells me that you like what I do, and I like knowing that you like what I do, because then we like each other all around, and it's awesome. You can also find me on Twitter, at JankShenanigans, and on Facebook, at www.facebook.com backslash JankyShenanigans. And, of course, more than anything, I hope you have a lovely day, or evening, or whenever. Thank you again for watching, and this is Janky Shenanigans. Signing out. I'm going to have to cut so much of this out. It's... Oh my god. We'll get there. Oh, that's going to be a whole rant unto itself. Whoops, wrong thing. I just shot someone. <laughs> and you can run. You can dodge. You can do whatever. You can do whatever in tactical laser tag, guys. I just walked off a cliff. That's what we call physical comedy. That should, instead of beleaguered, just call this series hot mess. <laughs> <laughs> so, thanks for watching. And I will see you next time.